DLM Dashboard is a free tool that tracks changes to your database schemas. In this video, I'll show you how to set up and start monitoring your databases in two minutes. Click Set up DLM Dashboard to begin. First, I need to enter the name of the SQL Server I want to connect to. You can choose SQL Server or Windows for authentication. I'll choose Windows Authentication, then add the server. Now I've connected, I can see a list of databases on the server. These databases are all part of the same system, so I'll monitor them by clicking Add next to each one. Then I'll click Home. Because these databases share similar schemas, DLM Dashboard has grouped them together into a pipeline called Widget. I'll use these drop-downs to categorise the databases by environment. This one's Production. This one's Testing. This one's Integration. And this one's Acceptance. The schema of my development environment is significantly different, so DLM Dashboard has created a new pipeline. That's no problem, I can manually move it to the widget pipeline using this drop-down. Then categorise it. From this page, you can see when there's been a change to one of your database schemas. The database will be marked as Drift if it's changed to an unrecognised schema. Here you can see that someone has made a change to my development database. You can review and acknowledge changes by clicking Review. You can also set up email notifications so that you're alerted to schema changes. To do this, click Notifications. I only want to be told when a database drifts to an unrecognised state, so I'm going to select this option. Now I need to enter the address I want the email sent to. and the address I want to be displayed in the From field. This doesn't have to be a real email address, unless you want to be able to reply to the notifications. Give DLM Dashboard an SMTP server and a port to use. Then click Save. DLM Dashboard is now set up to monitor my databases.